The term Banana Wars refers to a series of military interventions by the United States in Latin America and the Caribbean in the late 19th and early 20th centuries. The most well-known of these conflicts was the United States' involvement in the region's banana trade, which led to the deployment of U.S. Marines to protect American fruit companies. In the early 20th century, American fruit companies such as the United Fruit Company and the Standard Fruit Company began to expand their operations in Latin America and the Caribbean. These companies controlled vast plantations and controlled much of the region's banana trade, which was an important export for many countries in the region. However, the unstable political climate in many of these countries made it difficult for the fruit companies to operate without interference. In response, the companies began to lobby the U.S. government for military intervention to protect their investments. The U.S. government was sympathetic to the fruit company's cause, and in 1903, President Theodore Roosevelt issued the Roosevelt Corollary to the Monroe Doctrine, which gave the U.S. the right to intervene in Latin American countries to maintain stability and protect American interests. In the years that followed, U.S. Marines were sent to various countries in the region to protect American fruit companies. These interventions were often accompanied by violence, as the Marines clashed with local militias and insurgents. One of the most well-known conflicts of the Banana Wars was the U.S. intervention in Nicaragua in the 1,910 seconds. The U.S. government sent Marines to the country to protect American business interests, including the United Fruit Company. The Marines were involved in a number of clashes with local insurgents, and the conflict dragged on for several years. Similar interventions took place in other countries in the region, including Honduras, Guatemala, and Cuba. The U.S. Marines were often seen as enforcers for American business interests, and their presence was resented by many in the region. The Banana Wars had a lasting impact on the political and economic landscape of Latin America and the Caribbean. The interventions by the U.S. government helped to entrench the power of American fruit companies in the region and contributed to the perception of the U.S. as a dominant and imperialistic power. In conclusion, the Banana Wars were a series of military interventions by the U.S. in Latin America and the Caribbean in the early 20th century. These interventions were driven by the desire to protect American business interests, particularly in the region's banana trade. While the U.S. Marines were successful in protecting American investments, their presence was often resented by locals, and the conflicts had a lasting impact on the region's political and economic landscape.